Donna from Pilgrim Candle. Welcome. I'm going to be doing a demonstration with the Dixie Belle paint today. Behind the camera is my intern that I hired from Westfield State University, Samantha Palmer. She's been with me for a few months helping with the marketing and social media. So we're glad to have Samantha aboard. Glad to be here. <laughs> so what we're going to do is demonstrate with using the Dixie Bell Bunker Hill Blue, which I've kind of started here. But um, the reason being it's our color of the month. So I just lightly slide it over. It's a nice thin, thin coat, okay? If it gets a little thick in some areas, you can just take a mister and it allows you to spread your paint nice and even. This is so user-friendly, this Dixie Belle paint. And what makes it even more fun too is there's layers that you can add. There's stenciling, there's transfers, there's silk screening, all different things. Today, I'm gonna use some stars. So, and that does, it does dry pretty quickly. So that should be done by the time I am finished with my red stripes. So I've already used buttercream for my base and I'm gonna be using the Honky Tonk Red for my red stripes. So that means I need to change my paint here. So I hope everyone had a really good 4th of July weekend. I, we cannot complain about that weather, huh, Sam? Oh my mm -hmm. gosh. It's gorgeous. It was so, so beautiful, so perfect. And to have that rain yesterday was good for the grass and the plants. Mm -hmm. <laughs> So with the Dixie Belle product, you wanna be sure to mix it, everything um, that they have. Mix it really well because there's ingredients that are in them that activate them. So, um, you know, and just give you the true color. So we are going to, actually, I just wanted to show you that because we've already done our white, so I don't think I have to do another one. Okay, so that's, so we just have to do our red stripes. And what a heck of a time we had figuring this out, huh? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so. I'm gonna use my little guide here. Just move that over. I like to use the paint in the lid first. Okay, so gonna just dip in our red and just really don't want it heavy. We want it nice and light, okay? So on my first stripe is right about there, all right? So if I just do this much of a demonstration for you now, just depending on how much time, So I don't know if I mentioned, with the purchase of any of the Bunker Hill Blue, um, the month of July, you will receive a free Dixie Belle chip brush. If you have any questions about Dixie Belle paint, you can call me. My number is 413, or no, yeah, 413. 562-2635 <laughs> is the store. So what else is going on at Pilgrim Candle? We have a product of the week, which is, tell them, Sam. <laughs> this week, the product of the week is the wax melts and the mechanism, what are those called? Wax warmers. Wax warmer, um, yeah. With the purchase of a wax warmer, you get three free Pilgrim Candle wax melts in any scent of your choosing. That's deal. Yeah, it's pretty exciting. We do products of the week every week, so be sure to look out for those. 
Those will be on our Facebook page, Pilgrim Candle on Facebook. Yes, that is looking so nice. Facebook page, our website, Sam is cleaning that mess up. So we got a lot going on. Yes, yeah, so please go to the website. We have some new marketing material that have QR codes, so I'm like kind of up to date now. It's very exciting. <laughs> so I, uh, I like hanging around with the youth. You teach me a lot. <laughs> I try, I try. You teach me plenty as well. <laughs> Candle is uh, considered an elite dealer with the Dixie Bell. So I committed um, last year to carrying the entire line. So with that said, I am obligated to have everything, um, all the products. We do workshops also, I didn't mention that. We do workshops on Saturdays, but we will do them on Wednesday mornings as well. And it's a paint the piece, paint the piece workshop. Usually at 11 o'clock in the morning, you would bring a small piece for starters, a mirror, a small table, a frame, something like that to, um, to paint. And we'll give you all the materials and all the instructions to do the work. It ranges, the cost of it ranges because, you know, you can bring a small piece, but you can also bring a dresser or a table, um, something else that might take a little longer. So we'll, we'll keep it here while you're um, working on it. So if you need three sessions, they're three hour sessions. So if you need three, then um, you just come back. And we'll All right, folks, so this, I can work on this more, but this is where we are so far. And purposely did not make my stripes even, because probably because I couldn't. <laughs> um, but I'm happy with that. Okay, so now, see this dries so fast, it doesn't take a long time. Wow. So I can do my stars now. And once I do that, then we are going to I'm gonna just use a little small little, oh actually I have a little, um, I thought I did, oh yeah. I have a little stencil brush here, which I am going to just snip the edge, snip the, um, the tips a little bit, so they're not fly away and I get more of a nice, nice coating. So when I, when you stencil, you use um, very little on your brush. So I'm gonna use my paper to kind of dab it in between. All right, so now I get to use my buttercream. This is eight ounce size jar, and they're $13.95. I mean, it's the product, it's a great product, user friendly and affordable. So you can do multiple projects and not break the bank. Okay, so here goes my stars. So I, don't call me out. I know I don't have all the stars that are on the flag, but I'm gonna do as many as I can fit. So stenciling again, you don't want a lot of paint. And you just kind of go in circle motion. And I'm not doing complete coverage, I'm just Doing it freehand, making it a little rustic looking. Probably have a little bit of touching up to do, but it didn't come out too bad. I think what we'll do is come on um, another time to finish this off. And I'm thinking of doing like a, a wax or something over it to give it a little more vintage look, like a tea dyed look, and then maybe rough the edges here. But that's the American.
American flag. It's gorgeous. Thank you for the instruction. I created. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll see you again next Wednesday. Try to get on or get our act together by 11.30 and do a live. But for now, we'll submit the video and any questions, give me a call. Thanks for joining.